he slipped off the kitchen counter spraying for ants? Well, he was wearing socks. Are you aware that he has a drug problem? Really? If the man has a hairline skull fracture, we'll admit him, keep him overnight. One more. Give us a minute, okay? Enjoy it, because it's the last fucking drug you're ever going to take. I'm sorry, T. Shut the I... fuck up and listen to me. You're my nephew, Christopher. And I love you. But that's the only reason you're alive right now. For anybody else, anybody, they would have their fucking intervention right to the back of their head. You and me, we're close. We've done a lot of things for each other. That cop shot my father. I know what you're telling me. I'll never forget that. And this is how you repay me. I gotta worry if you're gonna flip over a nickel bag of white powder. No, Tony, never. You lied to me. I told you you were the future of this family. I gave you that responsibility, and you looked me in the eye, and you accepted it, and you were fucking high. Tony. Shut up. Tomorrow morning, you're gonna go with Patsy up to this rehab place in Pennsylvania. You're going in, you're staying in. You're going to every fucking session, and you're gonna keep your mouth shut. Now, if you need anything, anything at all, Patsy's gonna be half a mile away from you in a motel. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? Huh? Do you understand? Tony, I'm sorry. I didn't fucking get to this. 